Are you a musician? Do you struggle to play in compound meters? That was wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Does this look like you? If you answered yes to any of these questions, then this video is for you. Hello fellow students, and welcome to RL Skills 2. Today, we will be learning about compound meters. And what are compound meters? Well, a compound meter is a meter that is written with a time signature that shows the number of divisions of beats in each measure, as opposed to the number of beats. For example, there's 6-8, 9-8, and 12-8. Actually, any meter where the upper number is a multiple of 3 is considered a compound meter. In compound meters, the beat is divided into three parts. The lower number in the signature represents not the beat itself, but the three-part division of the beat. Often, when you see a compound meter, it means the music is supposed to be played very dance-like. Now, let's try conducting compound meters. Let's start with 6-8. This one will conduct in two, like this. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now you try. Ready? Go. Next is 9 8. You try. Ready? Go. 1 2 3 1 2 3 1 2 3 1 2 3 1 2 3 1 2 3. Last, we'll try 12 8. This one is counted in 4. Like this 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12. Now you try. Ready? Go. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Oh, hello. I didn't see you there. Go. Here are some examples of solos in compound meters. <laughs> directions, you can go from this to this. 